Will you leave me? It's okay if you don't want to answer. I'm being too desperate. I shouldn't force you. Cheng Shu, you'll always be my friend, be it now or in the future. I'll always stay by your side. I won't leave you. I'll stay with you like how you did when I was facing the darkness and chaos of the outside world. I'll be here as long as you need me to. Mr. Cheng, you have to pull yourself together. There's nothing that can defeat you. Nian, thank you. I don't know what to do now. I'm afraid that I can't see my brother anymore. I'm afraid... I'm afraid that he is already... My mom's sick too. I just realized that I can't do anything else other than keep her company. I'm too useless. I'm sure Lan Chuan will be fine. He's only away temporarily. Kijo and your family need you now. You have to hold it together now. The harder things get, the more courageous you have to be. You guys... Don't you dare touch him. Let me go. Why are you here again? I thought I've already made things clear to you. Come with me. I have something important to tell you. Good. I also want to ask why you sent Cheng Lun Chuan to Yilarana. What do you mean? Cheng Lun Chuan went missing in Yilarana. I'm sure you know about this, no? He's missing? No. What does this have to do with me? It was arranged by the Goo Group. How could you not know about it? Why would Ten Lunch One go to Yularana without your authorization? I barely went back to the office these few days. Shen Luan is already giving me enough trouble. Are you guys suspecting that I planned Ten Lunch One's disappearance? I'll surely find out if it was you. For now, please leave our studio. I'm sorry for what happened to your brother. I'd be happy to offer my help if you ever needed. The Guru Group and Kijo are still partners after all. I just want to speak with you privately. I'll leave after that. Guyan Sheng, what's wrong with you? We're officially over. Don't act like an abandoned dog begging for other people's affection miserably. You really don't deserve it. I have nothing to say to you. I... I know I don't deserve it. You can scold me and yell at me all you want. But I don't want us to be over yet. I've already asked Guyan to find out everything. Everything from high school till now. Everything about how you saved me, about the wedding ring, about how you were kidnapped, and everything else. I know everything now. So what? I told you I don't care anymore. Do you really have to be this cruel? Guyan Sheng, we're not even done with what's happening now. You better stay away from Nian. Let him go if you really love him. Give him freedom. Don't come harassing him again and again like what you're doing now. How is this any different from what you did previously? Cheng Shu, I'll say this again. I have nothing to do with your brother's disappearance. Go to my office and look it up if you think I authorized him to go there. And who are you to Nyan Nan? Why are you intervening between us? Who are you to Nyan Nan then? Who are you to question me like this? Shu, whoops. Did I come at the wrong time? Why are you here? I snuck out when my dad wasn't home. Sho, you look so much better in these clothes. Nyan, I'll send this fella to the airport. Okay. Sho, will I be staying here for now? Follow me. Wait, I just sat down. Nyan, you don't have to push yourself. I'll be back as soon as I'm done with him. Call me immediately if Guyan Sheng tries anything. Nyan, see you soon. Is that Cheng Shou's friend? How come I've never heard about him at all?